for cleaning in the home and um, you'll see a lot of cleaning products will have like eucalyptus and tea tree oil because a lot of their properties are like the plant itself they're antibacterial antifungal anti everything <laughs> The blend and then use it within the oil or within the room and often you would give the client um, uh, like a sample to bring home welcome back to my spa series all about uh, recommendations for spa treatments little explanations guides as in what to pick and what to get and maybe um, encouraging you to try a new or different treatment that you haven't before and today we're delving into the world of aromatherapy so aromatherapy is the use of essential plant oils botanical extracts um, for their healing and therapeutic pro um, properties so you can use aromatherapy oils or essential oils um, they're very very concentrated so you do have to dilute them or get a specific blend um, that like a pre-blended version I would recommend because they're more powerful they're like perfume if they work two or three together you know like the top note middle note um, in perfume like one that stays the scent stays longer so you can use it in your home and um, you can use it on your skin in certain versions very diluted um, you can it's so good for your beauty regime for your spa and relaxation element and even for cleaning in the home and um, you'll see a lot of cleaning products will have like eucalyptus and tea tree oil because a lot of their properties are like the plant itself they're antibacterial antifungal anti everything <laughs> it's really good to have it's like a natural uh, use what mother nature has already designed it's already been designed it's out there don't try to reinvent the wheel um so aromatherapy is a beautiful beautiful treatment to get so normally the therapist would greet you and then consult with you um because certain oils um can influence your mood and how you're feeling they can in the body also like release muscle tension uh, like um, black pepper is really good for that um, lavender for like soothing and calming if somebody's having sleep um, problems that can help them calm and relax but they can actually change your emotions like your actual mood so the therapist would chat with how you're feeling what are your energy levels like and then they would customize um, a blend for you so if you're trained in aromatherapy you learn how to put the blends together properly um, and then they would use it within the oil itself if your skin um if you're not allergic or not too sensitive or they would also use it like in the room in like an aromatherapy diffuser um or you can get like even at home a little candle with you know wax melts um a little wax holder candle holder will have um sometimes you can put it the aromatherapy in the actual um, aromatherapy burner so it can be the scent in the room um, but our memory is linked to scents very very strongly and women especially are very sensitive to smells and um, it can directly bring you back to a memory because your smell gland is very close to like um, physically very close to the part of the brain that's linked to memory so um, aromatherapy can uh, provoke like evoke such um such powerful it has such a powerful impact and it's completely underestimated but basically when you go in for a treatment she's going to they will consult with you and uh, what they're going to do is make up the blend and then use it within the oil or within the room and often you would give the client um uh, like a sample to bring home whether it's on a tissue to use throughout the day or the smell or you can get aromatherapy body oils um, as a moisturizer and you can get roller a uh, little roller ball that you use on your pulse points and um, so it's like a small uh, little 
little tube of the oil that you take home with you and you can put it behind your ears and all these points that are really like the skin is really absorbent in these points where you would naturally put perfume anyway um, uh, so they really can be absorbed by the skin and go in through the uh, the system and they're like a lot of them are natural um, plant based uh, so aromatherapy has been around or botanical extracts in beauty have been around in centuries that's the original form of beauty um, so the ancient Greeks ancient Egyptians um, even Cleopatra was known to use like rose petals in her milk baths and rose would be um, like using the flowers to extract um, the aromatherapy from them uh, so some really popular and easy to use um, aromatherapy essential oils are uh, peppermint is so good around the home it's really uplifting it's really inspiring it changes your mood it's a great neutral scent for everybody in the home and um, it smells really clean really fresh and then it will actually like be antiviral in the air um, eucalyptus is the same really good for breathing you'll see that in a lot of products for like colds and flus and like it helps clear the nostril passage from bacteria and everything it's really good to stay healthy in the home to be having um, eucalyptus burning in the background um lemon is a fabulous one or lime is really affordable um essential oil of lime again is really great in the morning time or if you're um have that afternoon slump in the office it's fabulous to have at your desk or in the little rollerball and to use quickly have a sniff it just wakes you up again it's really really refreshing uh, lavender is great for sleep and then clary sage is another one which is really really powerful especially again during labor for women and then um, for sleep you can get that in sleep blends or chamomile is great chamomile is good to use diluted like on the skin uh, for sensitive it's really good for soothing chamomile is good for children that's like a lighter version to help them go asleep so you'll see a lot of products like pillow spray um, bath uh, salts bath they'll all have like aromatherapy in them botanical extracts essential oils and um, so always um, make sure to go to like a health food store or to um, somewhere where the essential oil it's pure plant extract and not um, an artificial perfume that's trying to mimic that smell um, especially if you're applying it to your body be very careful that it's um, diluted and that it's uh, from a reputable source and that it's actually essential oil so it's the plant extract itself and um, the flower extract or the herbs um, thyme is another popular one rosemary smells fabulous and they tend to use that in a lot of like hair growth products um, that I've seen so you can see it's it's used across an array of like beauty health home um, you can use them even with your pet tea tree oil if they've hurt their paw um, if it's a dog <laughs> Uh, yeah, so I'd really encourage you to try um, rose and bergamot and frankincense, rose, myrrh. There's all beautiful floral smells if you like that kind of thing, or the more uh, citrus, um, lime, and then lemon is really nice and refreshing. Eucalyptus, tea tree oil is a very powerful, strong one. Um, people so at your next spa visit, I really hope you consider aromatherapy massage. Uh, let me know if you've had this done before and let me know an oil blend down below in the comments um, that you'd recommend for others to use. And I'd really encourage you to try this treatment, use the oils around your home and I hope they really help benefit. Um, use them to uh, as a toolkit, use them to uh, when you're tired and you need energy to give you that boost when you're sleepy and trying to fall asleep but you're 
irritated and you can't that you use them to soothe your mind um, that you can use them on your skin you use them to keep your house clean and hopefully um, aromatherapy will be such a tool for you in your life and something you can really use to maximize your health and your beauty and let me know down in the comments below if you want more details on this topic let me know if you've had an actual spa treatment where they've worked this into this um you can have it done during re reflexology as well they can literally add aromatherapy into like an indian head massage for hair growth would be great um and let me know because the massage is a lot more powerful it's like um not just a normal massage is also like a therapeutic massage. It has a reason, a purpose, an intention behind it. So it's more powerful. So why go for just a normal massage when you can do all these um, fabulous like extras and, and things that will increase the impact of the massage. So you get the most out of it and um, your time is precious. <laughs> that hour massage, you want to make the most of it. So try all these different um techniques i also have um another video on hot stone massage and lomi lomi hawaiian massage so try um let me know down below if in the comments uh which ones you prefer and if you want me to do a series on um explaining any other spa treatments because uh, sometimes it might say it on the spa menu but we don't always know exactly what it means um, especially if you're not used to going to the spa that often um, and it's nice to kind of know beforehand uh, to be a really informed customer as well and to um, just to know that you have options and choices and um, hopefully this guide will encourage you to try it and have the confidence to do so as well and um, I just want to spread the knowledge of the and the wisdom um, of all these beautiful spa treatments that are out there so until next time